So today we have a Sunny Roo 2 kilowatt inverter which is showing an ER00 error. As you can see it there on the screen, ER00 and the green light is flashing where it should be uh, on constant if it was actually working. So uh, what the, the uh, Sunny Roo inverter manual has to say about the ER00 error is, it's, is that the inverter is in soft start procedure but the DC bus cannot reach and maintain the anticipated uh, charging voltage and so it's, it's trying to reach this reach its charging voltage but it's not able to um, reach it or and maintain it so what the uh, manual recommends is you try and reboot the system and see if that uh, fixes it and so we'll do that right now so first up as we can see from the shutdown procedure we turn off the AC solar supply main switch located in the switchboard so here it is here, the solar supply main switch, so we should switch that off. And then the rest of the shutdown procedure is turn off the inverter, the isolator at the inverter. In this case there isn't one, because it's right next to the switchboard. And then we turn off the PV ray isolator located next to the inverter. So here you see that right there. Just flip that off and we'll leave it off for a moment. All goes dead, and we'll give it a few seconds. And we'll try starting it back up. So it doesn't really matter which uh, order you turn things back on with, but we'll turn on the DC first, and we'll turn on the solar supply main switch. Then the startup procedure usually takes a, uh, a couple of minutes, so we'll just wait here for it. Now, unfortunately, the Sunny Roo inverters have had a lot of problems with them, so uh, and the, the manufacturer is no longer around. The, the Sunny Roo uh, company is no longer around, so unfortunately, no warranty is actually uh, valid with these systems anymore. So, pretty much, the only be the best option is just to replace it. You can um, get it repaired, but in my opinion, what's the point of, of paying money to get it repaired? when uh, you're still left with an inverter which is of inferior quality and with no warranty you may as well just bite the bullet and, uh, and get it replaced with a good quality one so let's just see on the side here on this sunny roof you can see the uh, the model number details model number SR2000 here and we've got the other inf information about the uh, about the inverter so it's always handy if you are ringing up someone like Gold Coast Solar Power Solutions to fix your inverter to uh, to just uh, have that information handy so you know which model number it is. Let's have a look at the front now. Okay, so we're still coming up with this ER00, and uh, so it looks like rebooting the system hasn't changed anything at all. So, in this case, we're going to have to replace the inverter with a good quality one which has got a full warranty and uh, will work for years to come. Thanks very much for watching this video.